Hey, this is Mitchell from Soundbridge. Before we begin the tutorial, please take a moment to like, click the notification bell and subscribe so you're notified every time we release a new video tutorial. Doing so really helps us out with the YouTube algorithm and we appreciate the support. Let's continue with the video recap of our latest blog tutorial where I will show you how to apply volume automation to your vocals. Audio mixing's most time consuming step is volume automation. Even with perfect EQ and compression, the lead vocal level often needs help staying in the mix foreground. I'll show you how to use the volume automation on a lead vocal and other tips in this article. Because this vocal sequence has a wide dynamic range, I need to polish my volume control. Volume automation was used by automating the output level of the emequalizer, which I placed first in the effect chain. I also automated dry wet mix of the reverb effect, which helps the vocal sequence blend in better with the overall mix. Let's hear how the processed vocal sound in the full mix. I hope you will find this technique interesting and for a full blog article please visit our website at sunbridge.io.